Good evening. Welcome to .programming.blogspot.com. Uh, today I am talking about uh, how to design autocomplete type text box in Windows Form C Sharp. Uh, so first of all, add a text box in the form design view. Now. handle the form load event by double clicking on the form private void form one load here we can declare a function check autocomplete that is a function declaration part now generate the method stub uh, by the sign of this generate method stuff that is method stub or you can say the definition of the function first of all create a array uh, fruits with some items uh, apple orange grapes mangoes and mango red mangoes also so apple mango grapes orange yeah red orange that's enough now uh, set the autocomplete source of the text box so first of all change the name of the text box is fruit text so name the text box one now change the name of the fruit that is that fruit text the name of the fruit fruit text dot autocomplete source what is the autocomplete source that is a custom type so autocomplete source dot custom source now set the autocomplete mode Fruit text dot autocomplete mode autocomplete mode what is the mode that is the append mode I want to send the append mode so autocomplete mode dot suggested append it's a enumeration property and last one is fruit text dot autocomplete custom source dot add fruits oops it's a method of the add it's not support the array actually it support a single item only so add range method to support the array okay so remove the add okay now replace the add with the add range method okay now check it Now uh, check this. 
yeah that is apple now all items uh, appear on a single character Now the same example doing with the database fields. So first of all, uh, create a connection string in the app dot config file. add the uh, connection string tag uh, in the xaml file uh, add name is a con uh, con string data uh, connection string in which we can pass the data a source initial catalog and integrated security what is the data source that is the local db uh, backslash version 11.0 the backslash In the form one uh, create a SQL connection class instance SQL connection class is actually exist in the uh, system dot data dot SQL client namespace that is this system dot data dot uh, SQL client dot connection string uh, configuration manager does not exist in the current context so add a reference first of all uh, by right clicking and add a reference Configuration manager dot connection string dot to string con dot open and the name of the database is student student db table uh, there are lots of table so use the student database yeah that is only the single table that is students
uh, in the connection string pass the initial catalog that is the student that is the database name cmd dot command text equals to select name from uh, the table name that is student students is a table name data reader auto complete string collection mm, while reader dot read through which we can read the mm, particular uh, all rows of the table one by one so autocomp dot add this is the string collection in which we can add all the rows one by one rd dot get a string column is a one only uh, here is the change that is the string collection passed to the autocomplete custom source that is now run the application oops getting error yeah connection string is not passed some error yeah, it's on a string oops getting error again uh, index out of range it's a column number only zero because I get uh, select name from the student so here we get only single column so here is a zero save this and run it again Bill Smith mm. Jacob and James yeah thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial please keep watching my all video tutorials thank you thank you very much